Well, good morning. Today is December 15th, and we are heading uh, down the path still of our Via Advent, our, our reflections and meditations towards the coming of the Christ child at Christmas. And today, day 19, we have the chapter John, which opens up with a fantastic quote by a great book. And I was delighted that, um, that, that this was quoted. Uh, the, the book Blue Like Jazz by Don, Donald Miller. I'll read the quote. Wonder is that feeling we get when we let go of our silly answers, our mapped out rules that we want God to follow. I don't think, th I don't think there is any better worship than wonder. And for me, wonder is really a, a way of letting go of how I think the world should happen uh, or my fears of how it, it, it also may happen. Uh, my, you know, my, my anxiety of, 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 uh, and fear or my control and need to, to, you know, to like have it my way and step into a wonder where, where I can actually live into Paul's words that God is infinitely more capable than anything we can ask or imagine, which is so true in, in the gospel story. In fact, in all the, the scripture story, both Hebrew and Christian texts, and yet how easy is it for, for me, I'll say, to forget um, that God has a perspective and a, and, and a process and, and a presence that my finite and physical self can't comprehend, but I can lean into and follow. And so, I, you know, the story of John naming uh, his son, I'm sorry, the story of Zechariah naming his son John, you know, I mean, it's no big deal that in our, in our day and age that really you can name your kids kind of whatever you want. But back then, this was a, this was a, a really strange thing, uh, offensive even possibly. Um, and yet that is what God does, breaks the rules to start something new. I'm also taken to because, you know, having studied Hebrew, uh, you know, uh, my son is, is Jonathan, which is Hebrew for, which is, uh, the, which is a Hebrew word, yo Natan. Uh, Natan is gift and, and yo is, is a word, is the Yahweh's word for God. So Jonathan means God's gift. Um, and so John is that God, the gracious giver. And so that was a fun connection. Um, I invite you to wonder today. When you catch yourself in either anxiety or worry or control and fear, stop and wonder and ask yourself, what does God know that I don't know right now? How will this play out uh, to ultimately the good of all? And realize that in that moment, you are worshiping, just like you are singing a hymn in, in the pews of St. Mary's. Uh, you are worshiping and reflecting and being present to, to the presence of love and grace in our world. God. Let's pray. Blessed be the Lord God of Israel, for he has visited and redeemed his people and then ra has raised up a mighty salvation for us in the house of his servant David, as he spoke by the mouth of his holy prophets, which have been since the world began, that we should be saved from our enemies and from the hands of all that hate us, to perform the mercy promised to our forefathers and to remember his holy covenant, to perform the oath which he swore to our forefather Abraham that he would give us. Blessings. See you tomorrow.